everybody, it's Tamara Henry here at the Tribeca Film Festival. You're watching Real TV Films, and we just caught up with the director, writer of the film, Mark Got a Room. Yes. Your name is Brian Hecker, so nice to yes. see you. Yes, nice to see you. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, I was for just listening to you. Me. Yeah, I was listening to you talk about your film. It sounds like a charming movie, and it was born of your own experience growing up, right? And your yes. prom. Experience. Yes, I was a total loser growing up in <laughs> South Florida. My parents completely embarrassed me growing up. And uh, so this is a movie basically about me as, a, as an 18-year-old trying to find a prom date and being very unsuccessful in my endeavor and uh, watching my parents being dragged on their dates uh, and watching them try to find love and being unsuccessful in their pursuits. So it's oh, like I see. So it was mommy, daddy's fault, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, of course. We always need a scapegoat. <laughs> right. Yeah, absolutely. It reminds me of a book I read called The Spiritual Advantages of a Painful Childhood. There you go. There so you go. How, as how a did, writer, it's amazing yeah. to have all this misery and pain. Right. So how did it help you grow? What have you learned about humanity? Well, the themes of the movie ultimately uh, tap into this idea of, you know, sort of letting go of this comparison mindset of worrying about what everybody else is doing, having a better prom night because, you know, your friends are doing something else, and just sort of embracing what you have, what's available to you in your life. Right, because I guess the comparison, all the guys think I have to have the hot, hot girl for my prom date. Exactly. And if you don't compare to the other people, then you don't stack up. Ex then, exactly. Then and, every, and nobody's happy. <laughs> Everybody's comparing their, their them even though even the guys with the hot dates right. are they're still looking to yeah, the they other want guy. the hotter girl. So okay, so William H Macy, yes. is this your dream to be able to direct him? Tell us tell us about that. Oh my God, William H Macy is the <laughs> coolest actor ever. I heard it was outrageous. It was quirky. It was it's wonderful. Pretty wonderful. I mean, usually if the script's good, unless you mess it up, right, it's going to be good. And it was a wonderful script. And Brian was a really self-assured, even though he's a first-time director, although right. not really. He's directed a good bit. Brian Heckler, pretty, right? Yeah, pretty fun. I mean, it was such a How thrill. did you land that? He liked the script. Uh, my, I have amazing producers who made you it all You got the him. word on that. Oh, my God. What did you think when he said yes? Did you jump up and down? Where, you, you have to remember the moment when he said when you got the word. Yes, I had just seen him in the movie Edmund, and it was like... I, I, I text messaged my producer immediately after and I said we have to get William H. Macy to be in our movie because the, the tone of the movie is very dry it's uh, it's you know it's very subtle deadpan and Macy there's nobody like Macy that does that kind of comedy style so I got to meet him and, and he was so cool he's such a generous man and yeah it was great alright and what about Cheryl Hines as well she's coming down the red carpet right now oh yeah I'm very excited to see her She's, uh, she's awesome. Cheryl Hines channeled my mother's energy. My, she plays my mother in the movie, and uh, she was great. She was also very helpful and, and uh, collaborative, and it was just, it was, I just felt very lucky to have them. I was, well, wait, where's Camille? She went with Craig. With Craig? Are you serious? What happened to his girlfriend? She had these bad sun blisters. Sun blisters? And so? And Dad was helping me find a date. Just now? Yeah. All right. Well, we look. We are so happy to meet you, and look forward to seeing your Thank film. You so much. And this is Tamara Henry. You're watching Real TV Films at Tribeca.